got holes, not for me. <laughs> so that's the ports for uh, where, the, um, where the deck will be. So I'm looking forward to that. I have to take off some branches. This tree will come out because it's not, um, it's not um, indigenous to here and it's an invasive species. Um, that the previous owners built, so we'll be taking that out, and uh, then we have some debris from a lot of the other work that we've been doing. But yeah, so it's coming along, and we'll have a deck soon. So this is the boathouse that came with our uh, property that we bought in 2020. My husband uh, just started building a deck off the back of it. Uh, they call it the boathouse. We have uh, a canoe. We don't keep boats in it. That's a um, workshop and my studio on the top. And there will be a deck off that. So I can sit out and look at the lake when it's done and have a breeze going through the studio. book two. So I wanted to ask a question what your introduction was to horror and um, mine wasn't actually in fiction it was in movies. I used to go to um, Saturday matinee horror films when I was a kid. Um, my parents uh, let me have a lot of um, freedom and I'd go downtown in our medium size to small town in London Ontario where I grew up and I'd go to Saturday matinees and sit there all day and watch um, one horror movie after another. And uh, that was my introduction to them and I loved them. Got introduced to The Telltale Heart and The Story of a Rat, The Ben, and many other horror classics, including um, I learned about Edgar Allan Poe and um, then I became uh, fascinated with um, not just fascinated with, but loved still to this day. My favorite horror filmmaker is um, Alfred Hitchcock, um, actually one of my favorite filmmakers of all time. And uh, so I wanted to talk about that. Um, a lot of people know Psycho and um, one, of, one, of, one of my favorites was um, Rear Window. And I just, I love the, the interplay with the characters and um, James Stewart is one of my favorite uh, classic all-time actors and I think um, he was also in North by Northwest. There's so many movies that I could name by Alfred Hitchcock, but he is absolutely my favorite. Um, so that was my introduction to uh, actually to horror before reading horror fiction. Um, and I think he was a master of um, just getting the, the vibe and the uh, um, telling a story of like um, what horror really is about. And I don't like horror that's, that's uh, this is a personal preference, um, the, the, the gore horror, um, I guess there's, there's a uh, There's, there's a, an audience for that. Um, I like, I like the interplay of um, the, the psychological and the terror aspect that comes through subtly. And he didn't, he didn't. Um, obviously, he had his movies were um, um, also for the time um, quite extraordinary for what he showed for fear. And I think they're indicative of their time. Um, post-World War II. Um, I also love film noir as um, a genre in film. And I think that uh, 
kind of um, melds with uh, with Alfred Hitchcock's horror. And there's, where, where is she? Um, there's, there's, there she is. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. Thank you. Thank you for the kisses. <laughs> so, I thought I would uh, talk about Alfred Hitchcock and um, get into that in uh, my next video, but I was interested as I like, I, I'm still recuperating from an injury and hopefully we'll get um, up to doing my uh, introduction as a newbie with all of the questions in the next week. We have Thanksgiving coming up here in Canada. So doing that and uh, we'll be, um, we'll be doing my uh, post after that in the next week. Uh, I love this time of year and uh, just thought I'd uh, put together another little montage that uh, shows something about um, the movie uh, Rear Window. <laughs> Not really, just what you can start thinking of when you're sitting there thinking and recuperating from an injury.